Members of Congress know and use these secrets. In this episode, I'm going to address what are the secrets to a tax-free retirement. So let me just share with you in this episode uh, what I talk about in this 38 pages, Secrets to a Tax-Free Retirement. It says, protect yourself from the dangers of increasing taxes, market volatility, by using my favorite vehicle, an MFTA, that stands for Max Funded Tax Advantaged IUL, Indexed Universal Life Insurance Contract, where I've earned average returns between seven to 10%, but many years we've had clients earn 25%, 30%, and even 61.33% this very year that I'm recording this episode in 2021. Now, what I always share in my various publications and my educational videos is that Americans do not have to put their money at risk, be subject to market losses in order to try to get ahead in the long run. You can participate when the markets go up, but not lose when the markets go down using one of my favorite strategies called indexing. And that's why I love to put money into an indexed universal life insurance contract so that I can accumulate my money tax-free and access my money tax-free knocks the socks off of a Roth and uh, be able to be immune from taxes, inflation, and market volatility. Let me show you the secrets to a tax-free retirement based on the actual Internal Revenue Code. You ready? In the Internal Revenue Code since 1986, tax reform. Who was president of the United States in 1986? Ronald Reagan. It was his second term. And so he passed what is called the 1986 Tax Reform Act. Ever since then, Americans only pay income tax on three types of income earned passive portfolio income, earned income, salaries, wages, passive income, that's like rental income or lease income. Portfolio income would be interest or dividends. Those are the only three types of income Americans pay income tax on, on the front page of your 1040 tax return. My favorite vehicle, which I call the laser fund, laser is an acronym that stands for liquid assets, safely earning returns, is not deemed earned passive or portfolio income. A million dollar nest egg can generate 80, 90, $100,000 a year of tax-free income. And people say, why is it tax-free? Well, it's a sacred tax-free cash cow in the Internal Revenue Code for over 107 years because it takes pressure off of the government to use tax dollars to take care of people who didn't save and on and on and on, or if they die prematurely. But if I simply cut to the chase, because the laser fund generates cash flow or income that is not fall under one of those three umbrellas, there is nowhere on a tax return to put it. It's not a secret. The IRS knows if you have one and the million dollar nest egg is generating 100,000 a year of income, they know it's tax free. They don't even need to audit you because it's been sheltered for over a century. It's not one of those three types of income, okay? So let me explain why and how. In the Internal Revenue Code, for over a century, Section 72E allows you to accumulate your money tax-free inside of a max-funded insurance contract. What's that? That's basically a life insurance contract where you're doing the opposite. Instead of trying to get a bunch of death benefit for the least premium, you're doing the opposite. You're trying to get away with the least amount of insurance the IRS will let you get away with and put in the most money, the most premium the IRS allows as fast as they allow because you're going to use it for living benefits, not just the death benefit. 72E says that I can accumulate my money inside of their tax-free. 7702 says you can access the money for living benefits tax-free. So that if you're in your 30s, 40s, 50s, it doesn't matter. Whenever you want to access money, you can access your money, including the gain, if you do it the smart way, without paying tax. This is far better than a Roth, by the way, and you can learn uh, with other videos on this very channel why. But 7702 uh, allows me to access my money tax-free. Section 101A of the Internal Revenue Code allows that any money that I have in my account, in my insurance contract when I die, now blossoms, increases in value and transfers tax-free. If I died right now at age 69, uh, every million would blossom to about two and a half million and transfer tax-free to my, my, my wife, my kids, my grandkids. There's not a Roth around that'll do that, see? And so these are like a sacred tax-free cash cow sections of the Internal Revenue Code. Now, Tefra, Defra, and Tamra are actually tax citations. You'll learn in the book that this is the Tax Equity Fiscal Responsibility Act of 1982, and this is the Deficit Reduction Act of 1984. It basically says, you know what? If you want to use one of these insurance contracts for living benefits, it shows you how you can squeeze down the death benefit as tight as possible based upon your age and gender, so it doesn't matter if you're a 22-year-old athletic marathon running female 
or if you're a 60 year old or if you are a 79 year old and you've had a adult onset diabetes a prostate cancer episode and three blocked arteries cleaned up with angioplasty i have a a friend of our family who had that we all can have one of these and we can be earning 11 percent and knitting 10 percent because the cost of the insurance that the irs says has to be there in order for it to be tax-free is the same for the 20 year old as the 60 year old as the 79 year old because the amount of insurance required goes down as you get older this is incredible you wouldn't believe how many uh, financial advisors and even insurance agents don't understand what i just said that's tefra and defra it gives parity tamra the technical and miscellaneous revenue act of 1988 says you have to fund it over at least four years in one day on the average okay if you're over age 50 you can do it faster than that if you're under age 50 in order to have it be tax-free when you access the money. You have to jump through certain hoops. So I've compared this off times to like a bucket. These talk about how uh, you can have the insurance qualify for tax-free accumulation, access, and transferability. Tamra basically says if you want to have tax-free income forever after, you want to be grandfathered to have that, your account is like a bucket. You design it to accommodate the amount of money you want to put in there, whether it's 20000 a year, a uh, hundred thousand a year a million a year see this is not like an ira or 401k you get to determine the amount of money you want to be grandfathered to put in there you don't have to put in that much you can make up or catch up for the years you don't put in the maximum amount but the fastest you can put it in based upon tamra is 20 percent a year so let's say i want to be grandfathered to put in a grand total of five hundred thousand dollars i could put in up to a hundred grand a year a hundred thousand the first day of the first year a hundred thousand the first day of the second year and then the third year and the fourth year and finally in the fifth year which is actually four years and one day later i have my five hundred thousand in there and this thing can double to a million a million doubles to two million two million doubles to four million four million doubles to eight million yeah we've had many clients who have experienced that exact scenario and now whatever you end up with when you retire eight million dollars we have a client with eight million bucks it's generating six hundred to eight hundred thousand a year of tax-free income forever because they complied with tefra defra and tamra that's the power behind this so let's go through how it eliminates the dangers that i referenced earlier so why is the laser fund one of my favorite financial vehicles because i have found that most retirees outlive their money based upon three big dangers and the laser fund eliminates these dangers it makes yourself immune from them here we go the biggest danger is taxes taxes are not going down taxes most people believe are going to be higher in the future the laser funds tax-free inflation I can link my returns to the things that inflate. If inflation goes to 10%, I've usually earned 15 or more. If it goes to 15, I earn 20. If it goes to 20, I earn 25. You can learn how to outpace inflation by watching episodes on this very channel. Just search inflation, okay? And also, I eliminate the danger of market volatility because I can make money when the market goes up and not lose one dime due to market volatility when the market goes down using a strategy called indexing. So the greatest opportunities uh, is to convert to tax-free vehicles using the laser fund, link your returns to the things that inflate, so inflation helps you instead of hinders you, and use indexing so that when the market goes up, you get to benefit. When the market goes down, you don't lose. Sound too good to be true? No, we have thousands of people that have been utilizing this very strategy. Why do I like the laser fund? because it passes the liquidity test. I can access my money when I need it, anytime. I don't have to wait till I'm after age 59 and a half. I can put in whatever amount and I have access to it. Liquidity, I have safety, not only of the institution, but safety of principle. Any year I make money, that becomes newly protected principle. I lock in the gain I make and I reset. In 2017, we had a lot of clients that locked in gains of 16%, 25%. On a million dollars, they made 250,000. The next year, if the market would have crashed, they still would have had a million two hundred fifty thousand at the end of that year. They may not have made anything if the next year crashed, but they didn't lose. And so that's called safety of principle and then predictable rates of return that historically have beaten inflation.